The holidays are usually a busy time for local food banks, but for the Hunger Coalition in Blaine County, this year is even busier than usual. Right now, we're still serving two to three times the amount of people than we have um, in previous years. To date, we've served uh, one in four people or 25% of Blaine County. The Hunger Coalition says more than half of the county is considered food insecure or one crisis away, and the county was hit hard by the pandemic. Now we've seen what happens when that crisis happens to everybody at once. Usually the Hunger Coalition would hand out Thanksgiving packages with all the fix-ins. This year, that process looks a little different. We've had to completely streamline our distribution process. So it's curbside pickup. We are pre-packing um, uh, fresh fruit boxes and pantry staples and distributing it like that. So what we're gonna do this year is on Monday, have our Thanksgiving distribution with our regular food distribution. Over in the Magic Valley, the Idaho Food Bank and their partners are also gearing up for the holiday. Many of them are doing curbside pickups as well. Definitely taking all the precautions that are needed um, amongst the pandemic and doing things socially distance, you know, trying to stay outside as often as possible. Like the Hunger Coalition, they've been able to meet the unprecedented need for food thanks to the community's help. They say they're going to do everything they can to make sure everyone who needs food gets it. A lot of uh, our partners have mentioned to me that a lot of families or individuals are experiencing hunger for the first time and they're not sure where to go. They're not sure if there's help for them. And we, we just really want to emphasize that we are here to help and our partners are here to help. If you'd like to donate to either the Hunger Coalition or the Idaho Food Bank, or if you're in need of food, we'll have resources for you on our website. Just head to IdahoNews6.com. In Twin Falls, Natasha Williams, Idaho News 6.